good day. Today, I'll show you how to fix wireless connection problem with speed out Wi-Fi button. So what the speed out Wi-Fi button looks like? Let's take a look. Type wireless. As you can see, the wireless device Wi-Fi is grayed out here, meaning we cannot turn it on or off. To fix this problem, let's do some trial and error. The first thing we need to do is troubleshoot the network. To troubleshoot the network, right click on networks icon and select troubleshoot problems. It says turn on wireless capability and to turn it on, use a switch on the front or side of the computer or use function key. So there is no switch on this laptop so we'll use a function key F12 to do this. As you can see, the flight mode is turned on. And as I turn it off, Wi-Fi doesn't change. It's still off. So, let's select check to see if the problem is fixed. As we can see, there are two problems found. Wireless capability is turned off and the network cable is not properly plugged in or maybe broken. Let's close the troubleshoot. Next is to disable first and enable again the Wi-Fi connection. To do this, on Device Manager, select Network Adapter. As you can see, the adapter responsible for the Wi-Fi connection is the Rallink R2 RT3290 802.11bgn Wi-Fi adapter. So, right-click this adapter and select Disable. Yes. And enable it again. As we can see, nothing happens. So let's proceed to the third trial. Let's uninstall the driver. To do this, let's go to the device manager again. Right click on network adapters. Right click on Rallink RT3290 and select uninstall. 
So, this is the a pop-up dialogue box appears and let's delete the driver software for this device and select OK. So, the Wi-Fi adapter has now been removed or uninstalled. So, let's bring it back by using scan for hardware changes. As you can see, it changed to 802.11n wireless LAN card number 2. But still, wireless connection hasn't changed. So let's go to the fourth trial, which is the HP support assistant. So click this HP logo here on the task bar, HP utility center. So click on HP support assistant. So we'll see that the internet and security has this sign so let's choose HP network check yes So as you can see in the connection status, there are possible root causes. It's no network detected and a wireless networking is disabled. So let's select wireless networking is disabled. So as you can see, automatic repairs perform is to reset the 802.11 and wireless LAN card number 2 adapter. So as you can see, nothing changes. And it's close. Another one is to visit the HP site and to download the compatible network device. Since we are not connected on the internet, let us use another PC connected and download the network device driver.
let's insert the flash drive with the driver in it. So, here's the device driver and let's install it. Choose I accept the terms in the license agreement. But before you check it, Please be sure to read the license agreement. Click finish and as you can see the Wi-Fi button is not grayed out now and it displays the available Wi-Fi connection. And here it is. And that's it, that's how to fix wireless connection problem, create out Wi-Fi button. Thank you for watching, hit like and subscribe.